Both teams come into this game with 3-1 league records and are tied for second in the De Anza League. Wilcox is riding a three-game win streak and Patrick Sanchez is looking to make it four. In the three-game span, the senior reached first base nine times while recording five RBI and drew four walks. Standing in the Chargers' way is Eric Colgrove. The junior has a 1.5 ERA and is 3-2 on the season. Two of those wins were complete games. The righty also has 22 strikeouts on the year. The Eagles take on the Chargers in our CCS Sun Power Electric game. Top of the third, Eagles get things going as Gavin Moore sends one into the gap to right as a sophomore gets a standing double. A few batters later, Adam Kamen bounces a hit to third. The infielder stumbles. The throw to first is not in time. Kamen makes it to first as Moore trots home. Los Santos gets on the board first, one nothing. Bottom fourth now, and here's our guy, Patrick Sanchez, hitting a liner to center for a base knock. And that would spark a run for the Chargers as the very next batter, Matthew Tendez, launches the ball deep to center. Going, going, and it just stays in, going off of the fence. Sanchez hustles from first to score, and Tienda slides for third and is safe. Noel Ramirez up next, and the senior also gets a hit to center that goes over the outfielder's head. Tienda crosses home plate as Ramirez ends up at second and throttles the gas. Vroom, vroom. Jacob Purcell out the plate and makes it four consecutive hits for Wilcox, all four hits being extra base hits. This hit brings home Ramirez as Purcell goes to second. Chargers take a 3-1 lead. Top fifth, runner on first for the Eagles, and watch this lightning fast reflex from Jared Cabildo. Catching the line drive, then throwing to first to get the double play. Now that's how you end an inning. Wilcox tags on two more runs in the bottom of the fifth. Ramirez sends the chopper to third, makes it to first as Sanchez goes home from third. Chargers lead 5-1 after the fifth. Eagles try to start a rally in the bottom of the seventh as Durrell Wesley Jr. gets a hit down the first baseline that stays fair. The senior ends up at second. A couple of batters later, Moore smacks one to left that brings in Wesley Jr. from second to cut the deficit to three. Down to the final out, runners at first and second, the hit goes right to Braden Rosa to end the game. Ramirez leads the way with a monster performance and talks about the importance of the win after the game. You know, it means a lot. Um, I think we have a great team behind us. Uh, we've been working at practice. If we continue being like this, you know, we could probably win a league. In San Jose with the CCS Sun Power Electric game, I'm Ivan Garcia, 49ers Cal High Sports.